Hey everyone, I welcome you all to my channel. If you are a student or a working professional who wants to break into the data industry by becoming a data or a business analyst, then this channel is for you. I faced many challenges when I transitioned from non-technical field to data industry. Keeping those challenges in mind and whatsoever is important from an interview's perspective, I will upload quality content on SQL, Power BI, Microsoft Excel, Python, Tableau and statistics. On my channel, you will find end-to-end -end project videos, concept videos, interview questions and answers, scenario-based questions and case studies. Soon, I will be coming up with paid courses as well on topics like DAX, that is data analysis expressions. Then we have data modeling and power query editor. The best way, according to me, to become a data analyst is to learn the bare minimum that is required to get an entry-level job and then when you will start working, you will obviously get a chance to work with the real data and certainly it will be a good experience for you. And in that manner, you will learn and you will become definitely become a good data analyst. Also, if you have acquired the skills of a data analyst and suppose let's say there's a situation that you are still looking for a job or uh, uh, you are let's say you are uh, getting lesser calls or you are getting no calls then in that duration the best thing that you can do the best thing to excel is to create more and more projects since you know that practice makes a man perfect so the best thing to do in that duration is to practice practice and practice that's the best thing that you can do in that duration if you are looking for a job and you've acquired the skills of a data analyst also uh, there are other skills as well which are very important uh, for a data analyst like good communication, good presentation skills, email writing and so on. So I will be uploading the content related to these skills as well on my channel because uh, let's say you are working in an Indian company so there can be clients who are uh, you know based outside of India and it may be required that you'll have to communicate with them. You will be required to present uh, the reports or dashboards that you've created. It will be required to communicate with them, right? So again, that is also one of the important skills. So I'll be uploading the content related to all these skills as well on my channel. You will also find videos related to uh, a portfolio creation and making a portfolio because again, when uh, you will be applying for jobs, so it is required to send the portfolio to um, the recruiters and uh, that will show that uh, what all are the things that you know and how you have studied and what are the things that you have practiced and so on, right? Also, uh, don't forget to check the community section on my YouTube channel because I post relevant job opp opportunities there, especially for beginners because it is difficult for them to get a job, right? And not only this, when you will open the job posts in on my uh, YouTube channel in the community section, you will get to know about the minimum required skill set to get a job. Always remember uh, that I, I, I repeatedly I've been saying in my videos that you should always focus on the minimum skill set that is required to become a data analyst and then you should create your portfolio and then you should try to get a job as soon as possible because the, when you will uh, get a chance to do the job, you will certainly get a chance to work with the real data and that will give you the best experience. So that's all that I have to say. We'll meet in the next session. Till then, thank you. Bye-bye.